Remembering that I'll be dead soon is the most important tool I've ever encountered to help me make the big choices in life. Because almost everything, all external expectations, all pride, all fear of embarrassment or failure, these things just fall away in the face of death, leaving only what is truly important. Remembering that you are going to die is the best way I know to avoid the trap of thinking you have something to Wesley lose. Bradabra. What's up guys, it's your boy, hold on there's some cat hair or something on my mic and it makes me look like a baghead, can y'all hear me, shit working? Okay basically yeah, I basically wanted to make this video because I feel like I'm obligated to make this video for having passed this threshold, you know what I mean? Not only obligated, I want to do this video, you get me? Basically I want to talk about like what it, what it took for me to get to a thousand subscribers, this is a lot of people to click a button on a website which um, pretty much works against you, you know what I mean? Like, I know, I know because I was one of these people that there's people out there watching my channel being like, Lord of mercy, how the hell, you get me? And I'm basically making this video to say like, there is a human at the other side of these videos, like it is possible, like it's not like, it's not like a magic number that like, it doesn't even set man apart, I don't even believe like, it makes you, it's not like now I'm a qualified anything really, other than the fact that some other people from a council estate enjoy the, the media that I'm putting out from my council estate, you get me? That's all it is. So, pretty much, um, what does it take? It takes about 15 months of complete and utter isolation and dedication to making one thing and one thing only gaming videos <laughs> and um if anyone tells you anything other than that then they're lying bruv you get me or they're talking from a position of extreme beauty you know what i mean so it, coming from a normal person yeah it takes a lot a lot of work I'm not trying to discourage man, you know what I'm doing in this video yeah without sounding negative. I'm weeding out all the wimps, yeah. I'm weeding you all out, car. None of you <laughs> will make it to a thousand subscribers because it's hard. It's hard. And the best way for me to describe this, yeah, is to sit there and watch a clock for like 24 hours. And that's just a, a small representation of what it feels like to grow on YouTube. That's the best way for me to describe it. Yeah, it's like watching the clock because it's not a thing that happens, it's a thing that accumulates over time. Like a clock, time keeps going tight. You know what I mean? It doesn't happen. Uh, and another good way to like, I feel like it, to explain it is like a radio station, yeah? Imagine going on Radio 1, a man ain't there, you're in the car driving, yeah? You're just like listening to radio stations, pressing the button and that, you get me? Press next radio station and... This radio one's not there, bro. They're just, they're just gone for the day. Car man couldn't be, man couldn't be asked to wake up or something. That's basically that's fuck man up. No one's gonna go to radio one no more. That's basically what it's like with YouTube. You kind of just gotta be there. And the way I see it is, when a man comes back in six months' time, and you're still there doing the same thing, then maybe, maybe, like you'll get a couple subscribers. You get me? And um. I know I'm not even taught I'm not even gonna mention in this video anything about madness like what if you go viral and that there is no what if bruv it just doesn't exist in my world of making videos going viral and getting a million subscribers don't exist bruv you basically um, just need to make good videos as much as possible that's how I see it um, don't aim for viral I mean if opportunities come up to make madness make mad videos they make mad videos but what i learned is trying to make viral videos is pointless and it takes the fun out of making videos just make videos that come natural and you can keep doing for a long period of time that's how i see it i have this saying that i follow and i don't know who said it probably kevin hart something you get me is it kevin hart i don't know who the fuck it is yeah i mean it's just like just show up the most important thing here is just to show up and show out <laughs> you get me and like if you can do that you'll be blessed you'll be blessed um like you can't accept like failure as an option 
You know what I mean? I could have failed with this channel. I could have failed to get into a thousand, like, and I say I could have failed, but like, I'm not gonna fail because I will never stop it. And my goal was to get to a thousand subscribers, so I didn't fail at that and I'm happy. I'm just happy to be here and have a thousand subscribers. So I'm just gonna keep making videos for the foreseeable future and basically improve upon what I've done. And that brings me to another thing, improve upon what you do. Be your own biggest critic is a big part of what it takes to get to a thousand subscribers. And I believe if you can figure out what it takes to get to a thousand subscribers, um, hopefully you and me, we should be able to surpass this goal and carry on to 10,000, whatever. Because zero to a thousand, I believe is like, it's damn near impossible. And that's gotta be the hardest part fam. The only other part that's gonna be hard about a thousand to ten thousand is becoming more popular and in demand that's my worry and people giving a shit when like you don't turn up <laughs> that's my worry like i'm not worried about how hard it's gonna be because i've basically just got to eat sleep and repeat and self-improve like i'm my own biggest critic like if my video's fucked up like i i know trust me y'all don't have to tell me because <laughs> i've watched it 15 times maybe more I just wanted to make this video to humanize it. Yeah, it's a struggle. It is a struggle. Um, and I don't want to be like, don't try it. I want you guys, to, YouTube's a great thing. It's a madness. You can basically get like a following through doing something that you enjoy doing. That's wicked. But um, if you're going to come on here expecting like madness, like mad growth, like straight away, that's not how it works. It takes... Um, just basically showing up and there's tips and tricks in here to get one two extra subscribers but the reality of it is yeah you just have to make videos good videos often and wait like it takes time like i've literally made probably about a thousand videos and you guys are seeing less than 150 of them so uh yeah that's basically what it takes to get to a thousand subscribers in my world you get me Go down below and tell me anything different. And I know there's people out there who do less than me and have more subscribers than me, but like, don't bank on that, you get me? And best believe, go on their videos and see the 15 views when they've got two and a half something thousand subscribers, you get me? That's the problem, because they're out there begging man for subscribers and they've been doing it for eight years. That's why they got 2,000 subscribers, bro, and they don't post no videos, you get me? We ain't stupid, fam. And it's not about subscribers, subscribers ain't the thing, like, as long as you, obviously it's a thing, but in my head, as long as I'm over my, by the end of my life, I just want to be like a good like 50 to 100,000 subs and I can make like a healthy living, if that's possible at 50 to 1,000 subs. If that's enough traffic for me to make some money out of, I'm happy and we can all benefit and I can give back, that's basically it. If I can do that, life goal hit, there is nothing else. Get me. So, do your best. <laughs> do your best. Oh, it's not easy. You know, it's not easy. But I, I tell you what, it's easier than working any other job. Fuck that. You know what? I'd rather sit at this computer for 18 hours. I'll do 24 hour shifts, bro. I'll sleep in this position. Yeah, I mean, I'll just sleep here and then wake up and carry on working rather than go to work, bro. So, if you compare the two and two, you choose, it's up to you. Um, there's bare other options, you can do whatever. Is it worth, is, is it worth your life in a cubicle? Or is it worth you um, sharing your passion? I share my passion all day, bruv. All day, bruv. Mans can laugh at me. Mans can say this and say that, but yo, as long as I don't have to go to work, bruv, I'm happy, get me? I feel like I'm waffling on, but I hope this just brought it into reality and brought it into perspective. And the truth is anyone who's been subscribed here from like day one, which a few of you are, or like, um, you know, man isn't, man struggled at this, like big time. Like, this was hard for me. This didn't happen overnight. This happened over about 15 months. And I watched the video back in the day and it was this Chinese girl actually. I swear to God, I'll link her in the description. You get me the car this video, this was like the best tip I ever got. And she basically said, give it 12 to 36 months. And that goal's in my head. I was like, 36 months, how long is 36 months? 12, 24, that's three years. Give it one to three years to 
to decide whether yo youtube ain't for me if you guys need support at this i'm here don't go down in the comments and do some madness like asking for subscribers because that shit just doesn't work it's not worth it the way i see it is the 7.6 something billion people on the planet bruv you ain't gonna blow off my comments let's just face it just just do the videos bruv you're more likely to fucking go viral than you are to get 10 subscribers from my comments you get me that's the reality of it so um yeah i'm here for man you get me i know the struggle if y'all want support then hit me up in the comments i'll check you out trust me but like if man ain't on it man's posting some some madness and you're free don't be expecting to be coming working with man and you're free I'll, I'll respond to your things you get me but but um yeah i'm here like if people want to collaborate people want an opportunity like to just grow on youtube in any way yeah man i'm not saying like i'm here master of growth because to be honest with you i don't even know how i got here yeah me other than basically putting my personality into gta videos that's basically what i'm man i found a way to do that and people are responding to it so if there's people out there who are generally putting in work i'm open for collaborations bro all day big boy collaborations you get me but if you're just posting generic shit, i'm probably not going to collaborate with you but like i'm here to talk over instagram twitter facebook you get me hit me up on all them social media accounts and that and uh basically let's see what i'm going i appreciate everyone who's here i'm not going to stop making videos i'm going to do my best to speed up the process i'm trying to check in more you get me other than that guys we step pa um part six will be coming i've done it this is going to come before part six i'm sure but i'm editing part six now whether it will turn out as part six because sometimes my videos change just a change of name and delete some audio and boom new video yeah me but other than that we out i'm talking way too much way too much